Quarterfinals then begin out on court two. The breeze is picking up, conditions starting to get tricky as two USA teams go head to head for a spot in the semi finals. In the blue, the number four seeds, Emily Stockman and Megan Kraft. Cannon is slowing down, Stockman is ready to chase. If she's not slowing down, she's ready to dig. A good swing from Stockman to put it away. Cannon is looking to hit that gap and they are giving it to her and then a late move from Stockman causing all sorts of trouble at the moment for the team in white. Work just using the grandstand area of the centre court. Yeah, it's not tricky down there. Still swing with a beautiful dig in the pocket. It brushed the block, which is a little unfortunate for Megan Craft. It's a great reach. Oh, this is a good rally. This is just superb. A real leg burner and a fantastic hit from Megan Craft to finish. Without getting called for a fault, twice in that rally, completely off balance. Unbelievable hand setting. Right side working for the team in white at the moment. And it's courtesy of some terrific sponsor defence and pretty terrific hitting as well. She was running out of room, her momentum was going to. So the ball down the line onto Kraft. Goes through a lot of footwork before she comes in to hit that. I don't think the communication was quite there from Stockman and Kraft. It's another classic play off a beautiful set from Sponsil. Really good run of points for the team in white. And to raise. Another good deep serve. Kraft getting a bit of pressure for the first time in a long time and responds well. Sponsil and Cannon to try and defend as they go to the left side. So the two point advantage. Can they nick a bonus ball here to get to set point? Remember, Kraft and Stockman have not lost a set at this tournament yet. <laughs> what a pick. Oh, my goodness. One arm stab dig down the line. And then back comes Sponsil off a dream set. A touch. Again, overhand dig impressive and a very nice kill. Straight down the middle. Well class, well controlled. Not her best spike approach. Oh, this is brilliant. <laughs> well, we see it probably once a tournament, the old double block, and it nearly worked for this action. Thanks for joining us here on VB TV. And our volleyball world expert analyst, Damien Schumann, alongside me. Defender Supreme and Damien, you're going to get to watch two great defenders in this match. Cannon is struggling. She will go through runs like this, Damien, where she gets served a lot. You might be giving away what you're doing, but you're taking it at such a high spot. Okay, so for those of you, it's your first day here joining us. Well, first time we've seen the option ball in this match, and it is unsuccessful. Well read by Megan Craft. The wind at 23 miles per hour at the moment, and that's enough to influence the ball flight. Yeah, great work. Heard that. And it's a move that has worked out pretty well. Nice movement, so change up there from Cannon to try and find a different route to the sand. Must have touched the block, so had to come. Sponsil this time goes hard, and she can swing right through the ball as well. Great shot. Still got to find four points on their own serve, though. That's the team in white. Well, the number four seeds can get to 21 and take this game to the tiebreaker, which is, well, I was just about to say, Damien, where it looks like we're going. What do I know? Nice late move, big jump into the angle. Yeah, it feels like a very different game. And now these side outs, so important, and another one. Stockman will need to make a slight adjustment for that. First of all, though, back to the day job, side out. And this time, Cannon takes the ball that was going into the corner. Oh, it's another cracking set. 
but Stockman is on it. It touched the block though. Real chance here then. And chance taken. That's a terrific rally once again by Sponsil and Cannon. It looked like it was going to have to be a free ball back over to the team in blue. So we are scores level. It happened at 16 all in the first set. It's happened at 15 in the second set. From the team in blue. Goes to Cannon, sits in the pocket. Is she going line? No, stays there. Oh, it's a great read. High above the head as you can. Kraft goes hard at Cannon. Cannon sneaks around on the reverse set and then chops it back just as Stockman takes a little gamble on the line. Good work from Stockman. Still got that mini advantage. And again, the line shot is good. Very quickly back on the job, though. Oh, it's a great block. Well, we thought it was going to a tiebreaker before we came on air. That was our discussion. But it's been a fascinating encounter and the quality of play has been superb. Here's the chance. Here's the chance. And there we go. It's the tiebreaker to sort it out between these two teams. The tactics are so good from both teams at different stages. As Team in white then. Sarah Sponsel and Therese Cannon get off to the perfect start. Little dipper. 15 against Emily Stockman and Megan Craft, their compatriots. Place in the semi-finals. Up for grabs here in Cape Town. And that's another great peel. Well, a real tactical change again, Damien. We know where it's going. It's going to Cannon. Cannon has to keep negotiating her way past the block and past the defence of Stockman. And straight into the block. This tournament, Megan Craft and Emily Stockman serving are being made to work very hard here. It's another just dream set from Sponsil. Real danger signs for Stockman and Kraft at the moment with this scoreline. Need to side out this point. Stockman tested, lovely bump set. Really good mobility from Megan Kraft and what a way to bump that ball. The sun is out here in Cape Town. It's a beautiful day on Grand Parade. Uh, which team in this match is going to be feeling the love at the end? There's a place in the semi finals up for grabs in the first Stockman and Kraft on the Volleyball World Beach Pro Tour this year. Kraft goes around the back, another good set. Beautiful blocking from Cannon. They have to go again. This time Stockman threads the needle to make the play, but they are fighting hard. And Damien at the moment. They've shown this throughout the match. The time is now. They need points off their serve. Oh, it's good mobility. That's a stunning move from Megan Craft. Match, and all of a sudden, they've just got two defensive points off her. Oh, just to point in it, massive pressure on Sponsil, and she manages to make it work high off the hands. And away from her serving and away from her digging. 10-8, still a lead that the team in white can work with. Good peel again, nice dig down the centre by Sponsil. This is a massive hit, doesn't make it. Stockman still in the rally, and that's gone too tight to the block of Cannon. To Stockman, or she can go to Kraft, who will feel the pressure as well. She goes to Stockman. Must make side out. Makes it. Three point cushion, though, is still a match winning advantage. This is the team in white's game to lose. Spots Hill. It's hard to get off Kraft. Oh, it was playable, but it fell in that horrible, horrible position between blocker and defender. The deep serve down the middle, and it's an ace serve. Oh, that is going to relieve all the pressure. This then for a place in the semi finals. Sixth event where the USA will have had representation in the last four. It's whacked wide by Megan Craft, and that's a rather abrupt end to what was a terrific spectacle. What a game of beach volleyball.